सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू इंट्रॉन यूट्यूब चैनल एंड लर्निंग सेशन ऑफ लर्निंग पाइथन विद द इंट्रॉन इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी व्हाट इज एन एब्स्ट्रैक्शन एंड व्हाई डू यूज इट एंड हाउ वी कैन इंप्लीमेंट दैट सो एब्स्ट्रैक्शन इज नथिंग बट स्टैंडर्ड डेफिनेशन यू कैन से फॉर इट एज इट इज अ प्रोसेस ऑफ हाइडिंग द रियल इंप्लीमेंटेशन ऑफ एन एप्लीकेशन फ्रॉम द यूजर एंड शोइंग द इसेंशियल फीचर्स ओनली सो व्हाट यू विल डू यू विल शो द ओनली द इसेंशियल फीचर्स टू द यूजर you might be thinking why to use the abstraction so abstraction is used to reduce the complexity and to increase the efficiency so you might be uh, you might have heard that terms like abstract class abstract method so abstract class so what is an abstract class the abstract class is nothing but the class which has at least one abstract method it's called as an abstract class this is a simple definition you can see and next what is an abstract method so abstract method is the method which don't have body so we will just define it and keep it as it is so now let's see through an example how we can implement this all whatever we said through one definition so i want to create one class i will name it as an parent this is my class i want to make it as an abstract class so we can do like from abc import we are importing some modules and abstract method here we are importing the abc and abstract method modules so how we can make this parent class as an abstract class we can make like just passing this abc this syntax won't change it will be constant of importing the modules now this class will be called as an abstract class so abstract class have some rules like abstract class should have at least one abstract method so now let's create an abstract method if one one is my method and let's pass our self here so now how our compiler will understand that this is an abstract method so for that we can create like add read abstract method so now our compiler will understand that this is an abstract method so as said in the rules that abstract method don't have its body so we just here pass the pass keyword and its body of this abstract method will will be defined in the child class of this parent class so now let's make an child class so class child we want to make it the child of an parent class so this is a child and let's create here same method that is one one self and here we will give now body to this the abstract class present in the parent class so i will give here message and this is an child class it will give message as an it is an child class so we have said in the definition that abstract class must have at least one abstract method but it is also it is not compulsory that all the method should be abstract it can have some normal methods also along with the abstract methods like if i'll create here one more method fun2 here is my self parameter not parameter self word and let's i want to print something in this so i want to print like this is and parent class So now let's take our code and try to run it. I will. So it will give nothing because we have not created it object of this methods of this sorry class. So now let's create an object of obj is equal to here we should create an object of a child class child and by using this child we will first give call to this fun one method and secondly to the fun two method. Fun one is an abstract method. Obj dot fun one and next you can give call to fun two method that obj dot fun two. So now let's try to check our output what it gives. So here you can see this is a child class and this is a parent class will be printed. So there is basically one more rule. So you cannot create the object of an 
abstract class so you cannot create an object of this abstract class so now let's you want try to create and let's see what error it use obg you want to create of an parent so here it gives an error that can't instantiate abstract class parent with the abstract class learn one so we cannot create an object of an abstract class so here it should be child class so thank you friends and keep learning